So tonight, police are ramping up patrols in Center City after groups of rowdy teenagers have been causing trouble. This is Eyewitness News at 6, and we are streaming live on CBS News Philly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Cartalia. There were some arrests over the weekend. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Payu joins us now with the story. Jasmine. Yuki, Jess, good evening. Philadelphia police say three arrests were made over the weekend due to disorderly conduct. People we spoke with say they could not believe what they saw. I have no idea what the hell is going on here, but it ain't good. Disarray and disorder Saturday night as teenagers packed center city streets. My citizen app was going crazy. It was actually pretty scary. Lisa Wyatt was leaving work when she saw more than 50 teens dispersed along 10th and Market Streets and on SEPTA. Down at the L platform, they were running all through the platform. They were, they were, they jumped off the platform and were running across the tracks and everything. They were young. Young kids. The teens caused police to ramp up patrols in the fashion district. This has got to stop. This is crazy. This marking the second week in a row, young people forced officials to take action. The week prior, SEPTA officers arrested about six people due to groups fighting and possibly assaulting bystanders. Beyond the teenager, um, considering the the ramifications. Um, we're looking for, for the parents to, you know, drive that point home that you don't want to ruin your life with one bad mistake. Eyewitness News took concerns regarding juvenile activity to District Attorney Larry Krasner, who confirmed his office is investigating. We are doing what we believe is the right thing in, in terms of public safety, and that means protecting juveniles when they are victims of crimes, and it also means properly prosecuting them when they have perpetrated crimes. There they go. They're running. They're running. People are tired of being shut in, shut out, et cetera, in, in this pandemic, but uh, not vandalizing. That's just foolish. This is our home. SEPTA is advising people to use their SEPTA Transit Watch app on their phones. They can communicate directly with a transit officer and have, one, have someone sent to their location. We're live in Center City. Jasmine Payute, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jasmine, thank you.